about time. What's going on? Yeah. Yeah. Rumor Report. Rumor Report. This is the Rumor Report. Talk to him. With Angela Yee on The Breakfast Club. Yes, Chance the Rapper has announced that he is going to put his money where he mouth, his mouth is, which is he's very uh, popular for that because a lot of things that he wants to initiate, he does. He doesn't just talk about it. He is about it. And he is donating $1 million to Chicago Mental Health Services. Wow. He just announced he's giving that money. Uh, my state of mind, changing the way mental health services are accessed. So Drop, that's really dope that he's doing that. Dropping the cool bombs from my man Chance the Rapper. Mental health is definitely well. And I love the fact that the universe... Is conspiring for all of us to have these conversations about mental health. I'm glad that, you know, people are trying to eradicate the stigma of mental health, especially in the black community, because there's nothing wrong with getting as mentally healthy as possible. Mm -hmm. Now, you also announced the New Chance Arts and Literature Fund, and they'll be contributing one hundred thousand dollars to 20 more schools in Chicago. So that's dope as well. Salute so shout Chance out to the Chance the Rapper. Absolutely. Always out here doing the work. And hey, what the hell was Chance the Rapper doing with Joe Budden yesterday? Joe Budden, yeah, listen, Joe Budden is the king of not keeping the same energy. What do you mean? Because Joe Budden, and I told Joe this when he was here last time, Joe will talk about people and say things about people in a not so flattering way. And then when he sees them, he, he does not keep the same energy. And nowadays he's even taking flicks with them. Why was him and Chance the Rapper in a picture What do you yesterday? say about Chance? He always says that uh, Chance... Um, Chance is always so fake happy. He doesn't feel like a lot of the things Chance does is genuine. Mm. Yes, well, when you're basically. spending money like that and raising money for great purposes, I don't see how it can't be genuine. Can, can y'all please tweet Joe Budden and ask him why he never keeps the same energy with these people that he talks about? Please. But maybe he changed his mind. We always talk about growth, right? That is true. But you got to at least say to that person what you've been saying to them in their face first, and then y'all can move on. Because I don't chum- know what chum- conversation they had. No, but you got to say it publicly. Okay. You got to say it if you if you talk about somebody publicly when they when you see him face to face you got to have a public conversation with him and say it to their face publicly and then y'all can be cool afterwards. All right. Well, the game he is facing an arrest warrant because he did not show up to court, so he did not go to court for a hearing in his sexual assault case. They said he tried to claim that he was too busy. He filed some court documents saying he had contractual obligations, which also included Nick Cannon presents Wildin' Out Live. So now there is an arrest warrant for him. The judge did not agree with that and said that he was in contempt and issued a bench warrant for his arrest. And they treating the game like the IRS. Like, you going to pay? <laughs> Are you going to lock jail? you up? Absolutely. All right. And Tony Braxton, I know you guys haven't been watching Braxton Family Values, have you? I've no. seen this clip, though. I know, I know what you're about to talk about. Yes, and I think this is true for a lot of people, that she loves her family, Tony Braxton. But here's the thing. I am confessing that although I love my family, most of the time I don't like my family. Everyone in my family. Take a breath. Everybody. I feel like I'm angry at everybody in my family. I don't like my family. If they weren't my family, they wouldn't be my friends. I don't know if I can say that about my family. I love my family, but I don't like you. What's wrong with that? That's uh, the truth. Yeah. I ain't got no family members Who doesn't like that. feel that way? I guess I got a couple family members I don't like. Because you can't pick your family. You know what I'm saying? So <laughs> technically you love them by blood, but you may not like them for any other reason. You may not like their ways. You may not like their attitude. You may not like the way they talk to people. I got plenty of family members that I love but don't like. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm Angela Yee, and that is your rumor report. <laughs> 